Zemo, would you like to commentate the crew battle with me? All right, let's go. All right, we three people. That guy sucks. I invited Zeno. What's the name of the crew battle? Old school versus new school. So basically, Gen 1 so, uh, of uh, San Diego versus uh, Gen 3. Oh, you trying to commentate? Yeah. It's me and Zeno. Okay. Everyone get the fuck out. Can you try casters? I don't mind. Yeah. Tricasting? No, San Diego should do it. Dude, San Diego should go from zero commentary to tri commentary. <laughs> Damn. We only have four people yelling at the same time. That's the only type of commentary. Can we commentate when we have the same what? <laughs> yeah. really Can we really just really have the whole yeah. audience commentate? Yeah, so, holy crap. Yeah, the players Let's move over the mic a little bit. Dude, self con We, San Diego needs a side event for self commentary. Yes. I would be so good at that. I okay. Anyway. We got some. Yeah, I know. You never shut the fuck up. Got some try commentary going on here. You guys ready? Right. I'm definitely, definitely not. not. So. Can we get. Can so. We get more no, no, no more commentary. We're full back here. We're you full room. All right, sorry, Papa. Get back. Bye, Kevin. All right, so on the mic we have Gen Three Cap. We have uh, the the Boost Man himself, Ghosty. Ask me. And we have Zeno Kids, the best player in San Diego. Hello, everybody. I'm a god. Hi, Zeno. And right now we have. The old school versus new school San Diego crew battle. Are we already recording this? This is already live? This is a uh, recording. Okay, okay. so is, yeah. is this going to be part of the mod right here? What's up? Is this like, going to be part of the mod right here? Most likely. Probably. Okay, alright. I don't think they ever actually cut and, up the... Yeah, chop like, that up. Oh, well, that'd take a long time. I don't time. think it's yeah, part so. of SD anymore That's to, like, well, to separate the uh, recording. Do. do you? Yeah. Okay. Just the past three weeks, I haven't, except last week, last week I did the yeah. okay. end. Okay. So we'll see if Two. this introductory get, makes it in. Yeah, yeah. I want to make sure like the exposition, you know, is a part of the VOD so people can understand what's at stake here. Yeah, they can the truly storyline. take in the hype and experience right. the glory. Look, we have a little audience up there in front. I see, I see her and Chris. So Zeno, front row. You've been here longer than the three of us. What can you tell us about Gen One San Diego? Gen 1 SD is like an untold, unprecedented legacy. They were so strong and dominant. I'll start with Rickety back in like the old school Pew in the Office days where he would just body new grand finals left and right. And you know, since then we've all risen up. Was that like 2014, 2013? Probably around then, yeah, 2014. Okay. Because uh, Gen 2 came right after that, and that was like me, VG, mm -hmm. Maddox, and all that. But yeah, Gen 1 was so strong. And then Gen 3, starting generally like about a year ago, when yeah, like people, take, take. when people like me, go, uh, Golden Boy, uh, Pop Magoo, mm -hmm. and Justin, Justin, Justin started coming onto yeah. the scene. We also have Eggs and a bunch of other names that are coming up, pretty hot. And Steez, while well, he's been around longer than most of, most of the people on the Gen Three crew, uh, he's put in the Gen Three crew because his kind of like. His growth has come a lot in the Gen 3 era of San Diego. Yes, it has. I mean, he was around there during like the, the middle point through Gen 2. You know, he right. kind of made the transition to 3. That's when he started stepping up really, really hard. He's actually at this tournament tonight. He just beat Ion 2-1. You know, so right. really I can't even sick. believe that. I can't right. believe that's crazy. Body. Right. <laughs> we got uh, so, Coach J Falls. You can't see on the camera, but he's actually doing some coaching right now for uh, his team. Jason trying to talk okay. smack, but he ain't got nothing. So, <laughs> we're picking. School boys. We have the stage selection going on right now, or they're or they're mixing up some stuff on uh, settings. What are your guys' expectations for this crew battle? Oh, Gen 1's gonna fucking destroy Gen 3. I'm gonna Damn. say Gen 1 is going to show a very strong performance, but I'm not going to count the underdogs out. All right. Dude, these new dogs got nothing. I gotta root they for got my changed. homies. I gotta root for Gen 3. <laughs> Let's right. go. I understand. You got you root for the underdog. Uh, I, I understand, but you know you gotta you gotta fight for the winning side. True, All true. Right. So That's we're starting off. Ways. Gen three surgeon versus Gen one gold dart. Gold dart. All right. Ooh, let me tell you about gold dart. This man, Emmett, 
very talented player, you know, has a very large melee background. He was beating, you know, PR players with Kobe in melee. That's absurd. He comes over, he brings all that skill over to PM, and he still does phenomenal, you know? Mm -hmm. It's been working a lot. It hasn't come out recently, but he's trying to come out and show that he's still an adequate player. So let's see how Surgeon favors up against him. I did not quite see the character Goldar play. He's, uh, oh, we're about to see it right now. Should be Ike and or Kirby. Ooh, yeah, Kirby. Kirby. Okay. okay. All right, game well, one battlefield. I assume right, this Kirby right. will be character lock, so we're just going to be saying Golden Dart's oddly round dart Kirby. Oh, yes. <laughs> not your usual dart. <laughs> Surprisingly, Surge is off to a good start right now. Oh, oh it's a go, let's go. go. <laughs> that was a zero death to down air? Yeah, dude. Pretty nuts. All right, Gen 3 looking maybe not so hopeless for off the bat. I might have to eat my words, but hey, it's the first game, first set. You know, who knows? It could swing. They'll probably swing Gen 3's in Gen 1's way. Yeah, Gen 1's got the talent. You know, they've got the, the match history, adequate play, but Gen 3's got that heart, you know? They got right, that, yeah. that vigor, that valor, that young spirit. We oh! Okay. Uh, Gen 1, let's go with the taunt. Nice tech chase of the hammer. I like it. He's got, you know, I kind of noticed this little curvy kind of looks a little like Pac-Man. Oh! oh this is the back and forth right now. Yeah. We're not a minute in and already there's all these stocks gone. This is uh, Project M, but like how Project M, we like to see. Oh, you know? yeah. Stocks gone, taken, speed, fast. <laughs> Project stock lost. Other words that flying <laughs> speed, Sonic. Yep. Fast. Yes. All right, both trying to fool each other right now. Neutral trying to safely poke one another. Goldar gets his opening, doesn't get too much. Surgeon goes a really high with that game watch. It like, can't really get much off of this Kirby. It's not a frame. Right, down tilt up being able to be really aggressive with his tilts. Yeah. Surgeon missing a couple of confirms that he usually gets. Might be a little nerves, but he's playing really well right now. Yeah, it's definitely hard to play in a crew battle. Even when you know the opponent might be free, it's oh, nerves yeah. can get to you. It's, it affects definitely. everyone. Definitely. That could be the second factor that helps Gen 3 out is nerves. Yeah, I feel like that was a man right there, you know? Bigger yeah, he probably should have been in there. Definitely. All right, down tilt. Back in. Oh, 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 all right. right. Let's go. All right, sitting Gen. at a very high damage, but... See, this is why Gen 3 won't win, is they don't tech these things. They have to tech these things if they won't win. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, 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 there. Okay, that does you, take it. All did right. you know that there's actually armor on the startup of Kirby's down B? Oh, is yeah. there? There's... Yeah. Okay. It's quite surprising. Like, you don't think about it because you never have to hit the beginning of the move, but it right, looks like yeah. uh, there didn't... Uh... He got on the, was it after the end of the armor? Yeah, it used to be stronger in earlier iterations, but they took out the super armor for like a lighter, more so. Oh, there's super armor in that move? Oh yeah, that's was, pretty funny. It was very, very strong. Kirby's down beat. So let's see if Surgeon can finish off this stock and get out here with a two stock lead. Ooh, nice back yeah. air from Goldart. Yeah, Goldart right now, he's not expected to win, oh, he's just expected to take another stock and make this as easy for his team as possible. Oh yeah. Not that he won't really need to, because the rest of the team consists of what? Jason Waterfalls, Bobby for example. Yes. Bucket break! Bucket break that! Bucket break that! Seriously, you should have bucket break that. He should have, yeah. Yeah, yeah, you know. That's a thing your character has. It's pretty good. Oh, and that's oh, the upper right. Surgeon. New school looking pretty good. I didn't know that Kirby could kill that start. Kirby is a balloon, though, so. so. This is true. I just said going into that, uh, right before that match started, uh, Gen 3, not overall, like, you look at the roster. And on paper, it looks like Gen 1 should win. Mm -hmm. But Gen 3 is out here to prove that they can hang with top-level players. You can oh, yeah. say that? They are hungry to prove that. You can say that, but let's be real. Goldart is probably the most free member of that team. He is. Yeah. That is true, yeah. So... We'll see what happens. Yeah, we'll see what they're, they can bring to the play. with just kind of an easy first. You just throw gold dart right. out there, you know? So Probably Gen like take 1, care of it. sending in Okami to try to finish off Surgeon here. Oh, dude, Okami, Let me tell you about this Super man. Super old school. Old school. I remember him back in the SSS days when he was just bodying Larry Larry, Tyrant, K9, Kawhi Manita. Ah. Wow, he was, he was up there, huh? Yeah, dude, he's definitely one of the best representatives for San Diego, for both Melee and PM, and also PM Fun in fact. general. Just earlier tonight, mm -hmm. Justin knocked out o knocked Okami out of bracket. Yes, I saw that, actually. So, Insurgent, I believe, uh, beat Justin tonight. Ooh. So... 
transitive property. Yeah, by the transitive property. My transitive property, Surgeon's way better. Surgeon However, should get a four up. Now, the thing is, Surgeon's not expected to win. He only has one stock, so... Okami just has to play careful, not lose the stock, and just... Clean, just, just clean up the trash right now. Yeah. All right. Surgeon so trying to do his best to uh, get as much as he can. You know, just secure whatever lead that they can. As much as uh, many stocks as he can take. Yeah. Okami's job is just to tie things up. We'll see how this goes. Yes, yeah, so this is a 5v5, so we're at 5 and 4. Dude, Okami's tech chases are still phenomenal. It looks crispy. Mm -hmm. yeah. Nope. Not to show him any doubt. He's still, he's still got it. Mm -hmm. uh, he's got Game Watch at hypothetically kill percent in here. It really depends on uh, recovery off. Yeah, how Surgeon plays this right now. Oh, okay. Okay. The this oh, is a situation. Will this be a stock? Oh, no. Nope. Oh, that was an air right there. Surgeon was, Surgeon was not prepared to go onto the platform. Yeah, you really need to be attentive to where Sheik is going to go. If you know that you're holding ledge, then she's definitely going to go on stage. You need to punish that. Yeah. Be ready for it. You need to be ready. Sheik's... Oh, All right. Ooh. There we go. Oh, wait. Bucket break? Oh, yeah. No. <laughs> not the same. Right. He bucket break that. So, coming. Too late. Yeah. Finishing it up. Didn't lose a stock, so we're back to even. All Let's right. see who Gen 3 sends in next. Surgeon and Gold Dark, they don't exist. That never happened. <laughs> we're going into this fresh. It's only a 4v4. I yeah. don't know what people are talking Will they send in Justin to get some revenge? Maybe Justin. I have a feeling they're going to be tossing him up in there. I think, Yo, here we go. All right. This one. Wait, <laughs> My boy right. Justin coming in. All right, Justin did beat, he said earlier, he beat Okami earlier, so maybe the idea is he'll just do it again. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so let's find out. Yeah, too right. Uh, Justin, uh, resident Lucas main down here in SD. He's been on the come up really hard. He's beaten Filthy Casual, Okami. He's taken really good sets off him. Well, he's gotten game three last time, last set with numerous other top level players. Yes. So Justin's def. I've played him before. He's definitely a solid player. I definitely yeah. respect mm -hmm. Justin. I don't know much about Okami, except that he was an old. Top play. Justin, like, Justin's yeah. combo game, as someone who trains with them a lot, is terrifying. It yeah. makes you feel helpless. And he's only progressed with it. You know, his combo strings have gotten a lot more intelligent. He's placing hitboxes better. So let's see what he brings to play here this match. Uh, and we're starting at four stocks apiece. So thank you. There's no, there's no wild favor in anyone's direction. Yet. Both play neutral. Oh, coming gets a grab. Gets a grab. Oh. So far, he's gotten the DI mix-ups this time. He has him in the corner. Okay, Justin gets out now. Okami trying his best to pressure Justin back into the corner, but he makes his way to the stage. Gets a combo. Good mix-up on the throws, and it leads into a solid punish. And now he's off stage. Huge amount of damage for Okami. Yeah, Justin is just losing all these DI mix-ups and dying for it. Now Justin may have taken the, uh, the set earlier, but that expectations of, oh, I beat him, now I can beat him again, plus the nervousness of being in a crew battle, things may not go so well for him. If only I could see the game right now. Okay, that's better. <laughs> Yeah, Justin definitely must be feeling the pressure right now. Okami not really going in so much anymore. Now that he has a lead, he's able to secure more damage with needles and not have to worry about approaching as much. Yeah, it's definitely um, a trait of a good player. is one who knows how to play to their lead. Oh, yeah. So, oh, that fourth uh, He's off stage. Not. Yeah, doesn't that Justin was, not play That was just well kind of a lot of mom's spaghetti, I think, on that right side of the stage. Yeah. Oh, something, something's happening. Okami gets a tech chase sequence going on. Justin doesn't see spot. But Okami flubs up the uh, edge guard. Next attack. Uh, okay, okay, there's one. We take those. We take those. Everyone's, uh, everyone's kind of missing their thing. Oh, 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 Gets a grab. Oh. He wins the DI mix up again. Oh. Again. Gets it. Oh. He, just, he just used a PM. <laughs> okay. Justin has his last stock. Let's see if he can bring this back Justin, at least a little bit. His jaw is on the ground. He's getting de destroyed right now. Yeah, he isn't looking too He's hot. feeling Okami's wrath. Right, here we go. We got something oh, yeah. started. 
Because he's such a pressure, but we haven't, we haven't really doing. seen much of just Johnson's like amazing combo game so far. Yeah, he hasn't really yeah. been able to get it going. Like, Ami's doing a really good job in neutral, not letting him get those combos started. And like, even when he's getting the hits, he's just not securing them. He's not uh, following the DI. Perhaps just the crew battle nerves. Oh That's definitely possible. Back air. That back air sends not the way it looks like it should send. <laughs> right, yeah, that was kind of an odd. Oh, it was really good. Yeah, I got the fucking box in that one. This All should right. be an edge guard for a Kong right here. Yep, yep. Oh, oh, this is nice! Oh, oh, my god! He takes the blue balls! Drossing gets whopped. Yo, Golden right. Boy, though? My boy Angel? Hey. All right, you should you should wait to update the stocks until like after each round, so we can like see the game, cause we're like missing we're missing the game, we're, like can't really commentate it. All right, thanks. Oh, no. Whoa, sending oh, in the young meme, Pop Magoo. All right, Pop Magoo. Now, before I came here from Missouri, there was very few names that, names I knew of players in Soul Cow. Mm -hmm. One of the few names that I knew about was Pop Magoo. For some reason, I just knew he was a really good DK. What's the purpose of this? I don't know, but I guess he's a really good. So we're about to find out. Yeah, we'll see how well he does in this match. Uh, I would assume Okami has some DK experience, but I don't know if it's going to be enough to help with this iteration of the character, because DK has only gotten much stronger than DK. Oh yeah, punish game, everything. Is just Even then, like Okami has shown that his grab game is really solid. Mm -hmm. He's yes. good at getting those mix-ups. Like, basically, every time he got a throw, throw he never mix, got mix, missed the mix-up. He, he mixed up Justin each time. And let's see if he can do that to Pop Yeah, Okami also has, like, really good aerial shield pressure mix-ups. Like, he'll fade in and do, like, double fade on shield and grab, you know? Like, he'll do, like, jab. He's really good at mixing up his pressure options once he's in there. So this is just gonna be a game of don't get grabbed. Yeah, seriously, by either <laughs> character. You know, both have the same pressure and options. Oh! oh. Alright, good recovery. Okay, it might be difficult to cover that angle. The up with needles. So far, the player's being kind of patient. He gets the mix up. Not enough. TK is very heavy. Fancy. Okami up air. Not caring about anything about G3. Yeah, he's putting a ton of He's kind of right rocking up the numbers right now. Yeah. Right now, things are looking about as I expected to, or I expected to earlier. Just, uh. If Okami defeats Pop Magoot here, this is a huge lead because that's three players down. Old Gen 3 has his two players. Meanwhile, Okami plus three others on his team. Bamagoot has to take this. He has to stay on top of this game. Yeah, Okami is just like, he's putting on so much pressure right now. He's barely taken much percent since being on the spot. You know? Pop hasn't really got anything secure. Oh, fair? Up oh, fair. He gets a ding dong. Yep. Bamagoot's not going to challenge him. Catches it. Tournament winner. Nice reactions. Oh, shit. Pop Magoo was careless. Yeah, Okami is playing extremely clean. His neutral dash dance and like stealing moves out there to punish everything that Pop has thrown out. Pop doesn't really have an answer to that. Although he's been on push right now. Yeah, even if he's not familiar with this matchup, which he may be, he may not be. He's definitely showing his experience. Definitely. And an experienced player can deal with most matchups. Oh yeah. Oh, out yeah, there. Interesting that he went for that mix up. Yeah, it looked like he could have gone for it. probably a guaranteed kill, but he goes for a tech cheese option. Oh, dash tacking too? Alright, try to He got the blue, and that's all he has. Okay, he takes the stock. Alright, Gentry takes back a lead, however small. Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! Oh! 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 Pop Magoot showing when he's a young god. Oh yeah, definitely. <laughs> All right. So now we gotta see who the stock count is. We got. So now we got J Falls mm -hmm. as a possibility. Jason Water Falls. We also got Baba Ganoush, right? Yes. On Gen One and Oats. And Oats. And I believe Oats it looks is like right they now. will be sending oh. in Oats. We're gonna be saying a second cheek right, now. Now. 
Yeah, despite uh, Pompaku taking that game with a two stock lead, they're still two stocks behind. Right. Yeah, they gotta make up the small deficit. Right? We'll no, see. it's only smart. I don't know if Oates has been playing fairly often this oh, season. He, he was at We Live In a was few he? weeks ago, okay. and uh, he did really well. Beat a lot mm -hmm. of people. Hey, beat the he beat, crap out of beat Blank. Okay. I believe he got top four. Mm -hmm. So he's definitely not out of his prime or out of the game. By any yeah. means. Yes, definitely. And uh, he's a PR member. Pompacute's good, but he's not really a member of the okay. PR. He's not PR. We're, we're going to see how this goes. Oh, dude, these combos what? Break what? He got so much off that one exchange. That, that was sorry, amazing. Yeah. Alright, should I drop my face? Yo, oh, that, what? That, that, that combos. That actually combos. Earthquake yep. to the grab. Mm -hmm. Play a real thing. Oh, Back there. oh my god, he had oh, he's the balls to go for that grab. That should be an easy. Still oh, smash. Interesting decision. <laughs> oh my god. So, another, oh, a, an interesting thing about this player matchup. Is that when Oates was living in SD and Papa Doo came onto the scene, they used to team up for doubles like almost every tournament. So they're really familiar with how each other plays. Okay. Would you say Oates kind of might have helped teach Papa Goo the wheels of two heads of Smash Bros? Maybe a bit, yeah. I still feel like Papa Is this a father versus son battle? <laughs> <laughs> father versus son. Oh. Okay. Okay. How gets the grab? Okay. Oh, 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 do? oh, uh, not quite. Still How going. Still going. Oh, 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 oh. Character so dumb. Oh my <laughs> gosh. Pop Magoot's punish game yeah. is solid. That, that's that's a word to describe it. That's the only word I can think of right now. Yeah, he's holding his shield too long though. That's definitely exploitable. Pop's kind of afraid to be aggressive. Kind of <laughs> hopes to get like a shield trap or something where he gets stuff started. Okay, Oates map finishes up on line. Alright, Oat cements that two stock lead and keeps it. Oh, and man. so now we so get Golden Boy. Golden Boy. Boy. Now, the hometown I to, hero. I talked to Golden Boy earlier, and he told me he's very confident. He says he's going to win this crew battle. Yeah. And he, he better. He predicts a solid win for Gen 3. Not looking like it so far, yeah. but it's not over till it's over, right? Yeah, but not. We're going straight into it. Golden Boy, you know, I, I thought that meant him a while ago. I got to say, I like the spirit. Yeah, he has a fiery passion in that belly. He definitely embodies Roy as a character, I believe. Oh, yeah. Yes. For sure. He is a Roy player. A Roy main. And let's see if this helps him right now. As you see Oats. Ooh, the master. A wonderful F spell. Oh, right oh. Ooh, things not starting off well for our hero. Can Golden Roy do this? His tag says hope. Does he have hope or is hope dead? Yeah, he looks like he's playing a little shaky. He's not going for the typical fog, so you usually see him after his down tilt. Well, he might be a little nervous, especially after some bold claims. Yeah, that's a good roll by Oates. Ooh. Man, Oates is going to be all over the work. Oh, he goes to the grab release. Man, Oates is going to be yeah, he is on fire himself at the moment. But Oates had a uh, good, healthy breakfast this morning. Oh, yeah. He's just playing. He's playing on top of things right now. He's got all the energy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's 14 to 10 right now, yes, that's right. Ooh, oh my god, Mark, is he going to four, is he going to take all four stocks? It's not really technically four stock, but will he four stock him? No, okay, okay, okay. Good there we go. There we go. Here's Hope one. is alive. Will he do it? Down tilt. Ooh, he's by the corner again. This is a bad position for Roy. Gets the mix-up. Oh, this could oh, be it. He just has to get the kill. No! no! He misses the punish. That was a Gen 3 punish right there, guys. Good air damage. 
Oh, it's so close right now. Oh, go down. Back here. That does it. it takes okay. a, oh, whoa, it killed? Yeah, it killed. All right. So it's a three stock lead for Gen 1 right now? Yeah, it's still so pretty good. So three stock lead. Yeah. That, um, that looked pretty bad, but Golden Boy managed to rescue oh, that no. just in time. <laughs> the Salt Master himself, the, the villain of himself. San Diego. Baba Gadoosh. Baba Ganoosh. Papa Noosh. Formerly known as Boss. Yo, people want the wolf. They want the wolf. Dude, his wolf was looking pretty nice last night. We played some friendlies. Let's see if he brings it out. Is he gonna sandbag with wolf? He's not even gonna give Golden Boy the honor of his snake or his Meta Knight. Whatever, they gotta give Gen 1 some hope. Or Gen 3 some hope. All right. So, I don't know how much stuff they're going to put into the starter stage. Um, but I believe Bogdanish gets a pick. He's going to go PS2, which is a safe pick. Yeah. Yeah, good little stage. Now, I don't know how good Baba Got Woof is going to do, but uh, we'll find out. Did you like that? Baba Got Woof. Yeah, nice pick up on that. Mr. It's pretty subtle, you know? One thing Golden Boy is really good at is confirming in the power shields and the pressure. He's really good at power shielding anything. Staying, uh, staying out of pressure, say. Yeah. I see. Yeah, you definitely have to be as a Roy player, I believe, because uh, you're a glass cannon. And if you're a glass cannon, you can't just be. If you're not good defensive, you're going to die. Could that be it? Okay. Oh, okay, he takes the first Golden Boy taking the stock. <laughs> Jason Waterfalls coaching is immaculate, right? Coach Waterfalls. Coach Waterfalls. As they call him. Best coach in all of SoCal. Oh, oh. Anusha's pressure right now. Woo! Ooh. Ooh, he's doing some woof stuff. Oh, he's getting warmed up. Oh, that warm was... Okay, good sweet spot by Golden Boy, making it back. Oh, Yo, the, the power, power shield! I told you, the power shield! <laughs> he's really good at confirming those. He that is. was insane. Angel Gold. definitely spent time learning how to power shield. I mean, he's gotten it down pretty well. Okay. Oh, okay, that'll do it. Uh, and that takes Quick it. Good patient back here. And we're down to our last two for Gen 1. Dang. Let's go, Steez. Oh, wait, Steez is the last? Oh, well, then our stock count's off. Oh, yeah, the stock count is off. Yeah, yeah you're keeping track. Get on commentary. Do you want to switch? Yeah. Wait, let's switch. Alright. Okay, so Zeno will be heading out. We have Pop and Zoo coming on the mic right now. Oh, this one like This is a big deficit then. It's all up to Steve. I'm neutral on it. If you want to get on it, Wait, Hi. Did we count too many people? I think we counted an extra person. Uh, so no, it's it's, seven. Seven. it's four to seven. Well, you started at 24. Oh, yeah. You started at 24, did you? No, I. Yeah, he did. We have one more person left, and it's four to seven. Go, boss! So it's four to seven right now. Okay, it's four to seven. Oh, so the boat. Yeah, because it's Rouge and then J Paul. Yeah. Okay. So now it's stuck. So can Steez save this can, battle? Can Steez, not even the anchor, take seven stocks from two of the best players there? I'm gonna say no. Probably not. Spacey is, yeah, that may help him a bit. But he's also Ness. This isn't even like uh, Maganoosh's actual character. This is Baba Woof. Oh. <laughs> oh, yeah. just trying to destroy his spirit. Is that the bubble got woof angle? That's, that's what you get, dude. So, uh, if we lose this one, this will be my sixth lost crew battle out of six. Oh, this is actually looking pretty good. Oh, oh, oh my god, I'm so scared. Oh, okay, whatever. Yeah, so, okay, that's okay. not all right, Steez, if he wants to win this, he cannot lose this next stock. He has to take these next two stocks from Noosh. Otherwise, it's basically oh. unwinnable. Which, you know, probably isn't going to happen. Yeah. No faith in your no own team. Faith. Yeah. <laughs>
and I've lost five in a row. I, mean, so I had gonna, no patience. Maybe happen. you should do better in crew battles. I've, I've taken, I don't, I think I've, I don't think I've taken less You basically kind of saved the crew battle for your team. You like, gave your team a fighting chance. Actually, I think I took two. Oh! Yo! All right, we take them. Baba Gawoof. All right, two. So it comes down to this. Two SDs. Three to four. Twice. This crew battle surprisingly That wasn't even closer. hype, though. That was just what? kind of bad. No, yeah, Noosh. You gotta feel like Noosh didn't give 100% effort in that. Oh, no, definitely. He, he just wanted to fuck around. He was sandbagging. He doesn't care about PM anymore. If it weren't for that, this would have been, like, a le it wouldn't be as close as it is right now. It would be a slaughter. But you know what? We will take those every single day. Take them. Uh, J Falls isn't fucking around. He's gonna go his fucking main. He went Donkey Kong against me once. In Bracket? That's hilarious. Yeah. And Olimar. Oh, yeah. J Falls the best Olimar in Soul Count. Go, Steve. Alright, we got. Here we go. Alright, so if Steve could do this, I'm blaming it all on me. We this matchup is quite interesting. Oh my god, that was actually kinda good. So I think this matchup's kinda interesting because it's woman versus child. Wait, what? Wait, oh my god, why? I've done that a Who lot. Who gets that much range on the tether? So you said I'm the only one who does that. I guess there's another person. So my prediction of losing my five stock is now wrong. Oh, okay, okay that takes go. it. Steez did, Steez did win against Ion earlier today. It's so. doable because oh, Noosh threw away three stocks. Oh yeah, that, that's for sure. But we might, who knows? Maybe Steez could actually take some drift stocks. If he loses the stocks without any more damage, it's so hard. You have to get all off this punish. Nope. Uh -oh. Pew, pew. Man, what a what a forward air. Ah, uh, this is what the fuck. Oh, what a what was that edge guard? What a fun character. Jason's just fucking around right now. All right, this is in the bag. There's nothing Steez can do. I'm setting this up for the comeback, Steez. Come on. Nothing he can do. <laughs> Bruce Man wants to see this comeback. Come on, Stop. man. The crowd is dead quiet right now. Everyone's going for <laughs> Everyone's just waiting for this imminent death. <laughs> Does he have balls of steez? Can he do this? No, it's <laughs> it sounded more like steel in my head. Oh! Steezel. Oh? <laughs> Steve is focusing so hard. He's like a master. <laughs> and uh, all right, this this stock is like been going on way too long. Come on, like Steve's just someone ended loses now. stock. <laughs> Yo, okay, okay, okay. Two more, just two zero to death. Like it's easy. You know, or just not losing a neutral. You know, it's been more realistic. Yeah, back here. All right, all right, Gen three. What loses, a true battle. But only by two stocks. Experience over jank. That's true. 